Welcome to the Drug Conveyor. I'm Nick. Rachel's behind the camera. I'm from Australia. She's from South Korea. And we're traveling around the world. And we've made the Hesburger. So if you've never heard of Hesburger before, it's, it's actually a fast food chain that started in Finland. But there's ones in Latvia, Lithuania, here in Estonia. And we found it quite interesting because it is pretty much a carbon copy of McDonald's in every sense of the word. They've got their Happy Meals here, they've got their Hez Burger, which I've got today, which looks exactly like a Big Mac too. The whole place, everything, the branding, this place is seriously like a McDonald's without being a McDonald's. I've never seen anything like it, and we're going to try the burger right now for you. We've done takeaway, so oddly they put the, the drinks in a brown paper bag, which I've never seen before, but that's a nice little touch. Okay, that's our drinks. Mmm, okay. So this, the costing, just so you know, so the Hez Burger for a small meal was €5.20. So, pretty good. That probably ends up being about, I don't know, 8 bucks, 9 bucks, Australian dollars, so that's pretty good. The other thing that's quite interesting I've found here at Hez Burger is that when they give you chips, they put like a little serviette on top to cover it. Um, I find All right, that that's true. Very interesting. It's um, <laughs> so funny. The fries are really yummy. They're actually almost, they taste like homemade fries. If you look at it, it's got more of a yellow color than the Macca's fries. Same thinness, they look the same, but they are different and they're yummier. They, this, the fries beat McDonald's. Mmm, very yummy fries. So here's my Hesburger here. So this is the burger, this is their Big Mac, if you will. There you go, it comes with the covering. That's very good for takeaway. I must say the whole takeaway thing, we ordered a takeaway even though we're coming here um, to sit down just to see kind of how they did it. And it was very well done for takeaway, I must say. Okay, I'll just take this off. Well kept. Well kept, very good. So this is the Hez Burger. That's it, everyone. Two meat patties, you got pickles in there, lettuce, a lot of sauce, a lot of sauce, which I love. So I'm gonna give this a try, the Hez Burger for the first time. So that is what, like Big Mac? Mm. You can see how saucy it is. A lot of I don't know exactly what kind of sauces they put in here. But it is extremely yummy. I would say it probably tastes a bit more like a like a quarter pounder. In fact, like a double quarter pounder. It's almost identical to a double quarter pounder, but much better sauces. Which I've got all over my hand now. Um, overall, I would say it is an almost exact experience of McDonald's here in Estonia with Hesburger, but I would say personally, I reckon Hesburger is better. That's a bit cool. Be cool, I know. We're disappointing all these Marcus fans. Yeah, seriously, the, the just come here for the fries alone. The fries are really yummy. They're a bit greasy. Mm, they're definitely greasier, hundred percent. And I think I've noticed Estonians like grease, greasy food because. We tried some of their Estonian donuts yesterday and it was extremely greasy so I think they love greasy and you know I like greasy too so it works. not very healthy but the, the burger is better like in Australia they say the burger is better at Hungry Jack's well the burger is better at Hez Burger okay um actually I'm missing my oh yep I've got that actually oh. look at that okay. comes in a little carry Ooh. case as well one thing I instantly noticed it has burger, different to McDonald's, is that everything is cared. Do yeah, you think? There's more care, oh, 100%. Like even the you know, straw, the not, not, it's not you know, like a straw box, so it's separately packed. In a packet, yeah. yeah. There's more care. Mm -hmm. Normal Coke. Yes, this is like really fresh fries. Like you can see that oil hasn't been reused so much. Mm, that's true. Mmm, so yummy. I mean, mm. Mm. 
the chips are perfect and it's a little touch with this it's kind of good because this is a small size ch chips but because of these these things mm. tissues it looks bigger yeah they let it overflow and looks special yeah it, does it. it looks more special yeah <laughs> i agree it looks more homemade mm. and i've got my burger here Ooh, so the unwrapping. what's your favorite burger in mcdonald's for me my favorite is always double quarter uh, well, double quarter double quarter cheese pounder <laughs> no double quarter pounder double quarter pounder with my, cheese mm. So I got something similar, like this. Oh, no, the visual looks, looks like a nice. cheeseburger. Look how nice that bun looks. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 Yummy. Mm. It's good. Mm. It's got yummy pickles in there. Uh, in terms of pickles, I've noticed Estonians love preserved food. So gherkins, pickles, they are must here. Mm. We find them everywhere. In That's the supermarket, true. there is a like, big aisle. Um, so it's just a just random thought, nothing to do with this burger. <laughs> it's very, very similar to McDonald's, but it's not the same. No, no. Maybe more saucy? Yeah, definitely more saucy. More saucy, less less tomato sauce. Mm. Mm. And more mayonnaise. Kind more of. mayonnaise kind of thing. So what's your verdict? Which one's better, do you think? I prefer McDonald's. Really? Okay, that's a twist. Because that's more juicy. Mm. I think the patty in McDonald's is more juicy. Mm. I still like has I, I like the chips here. And I like the little, little Coke. Mm. I mean, yeah. it sounds weird because I prefer something little. <laughs> Sometimes um, the drinks are way too big in McDonald's and I'm not a huge fan of soft drinks. So this small size is just enough for me to, um, to digest all my food inside. So I like the size of it. Uh, the chips is crispy and it's really yummy. Um, yeah, I always regret not ordering large size of chips. Yeah, me too. <laughs> And the burger is it's good. It's good but not extraordinary. We need to order a fake McFlurry because why come to fake McDonald's without getting a fake McFlurry? So um, we're gonna try the Kedis Yatis, I think it's pronounced. Um, and see how it holds up to McDonald's desserts. We've got it. Look. Ooh, looks I think visually it looks very similar. Mm, looks very different to the photo though, I would say. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Look, it's got all those little chocolate bits in it. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Where is my Oreo? Mm. Where is my Oreo? I, I don't get it. I don't know. It seems very different to the pictures. Mm. <laughs> it's okay, it's yummy. Mm. I prefer McFlurry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's yes. not a video for begging out the Hetz burger. I love Hetz burger too. It's super cheap. I mean, it's much cheaper than any other restaurants. And um, the quality of food is always seems okay, seems good. Um, but I prefer McFlurry. <laughs> okay, there you go. What about you? I'm seeing some of the chunks now, actually. There is chunks in there. Okay, it's very soft serve. I didn't expect the crunch of the biscuit. Mm. I've never had a McFlurry before, actually, to be honest with you. Never? Never ever had a McFlurry. That's crazy. But I have had the McDonald's ice cream, the soft serve, the sundaes. And I must say, I prefer the McDonald's soft serve. Mm. I think McDonald's wins the, the dessert round. I think for me the main meal, Hesburger wins. But the dessert round, Macca's or McDonald's, you win. If people don't know, actually, sometimes you hear me and um, Rachel say Macca's instead of McDonald's. And that's because in Australia we call McDonald's Macca's. 
simply because of that, like no one calls it McDonald's. So it's just, it's odd for me to even say McDonald's because it's just Mac, it's, it's easy. That's just what we call it. So anyway. Well, we are teaching Australian slang. We're teaching you some Australian slang right there, Macca's for McDonald's. But this is still pretty good. It's a nice dessert, but it's just, Macca's wins the dessert round. Mm. I haven't been to Finland. We both actually haven't been there. But we've seen many Finnish people here, don't you think? Yeah. And quite a few. they've been really nice. One time we bumped into um, a Finnish person in a kind of bar. And he was off his face. He was so drunk. Mm. And he spilled his spirit um, on my arm too. The thing is, but then he was really friendly still. You know, I guess drunk people usually have more confidence and he started talking to us and he was like yeah Finland is very close you guys should come there so like actually both of us didn't really have any idea of Finland like we're gonna go to Sweden because Nick's uncle lives there he's a resident there um, whereas we have no tight and I knew that Finland would be such a beautiful place um, that's where Moomin is from, mm. so obviously that's a nice place, but didn't think about it and it makes me really want to visit Finland. Mm. What do you think? Do you like Finland? Um, is it worth to visit? Let me know in the comments below so we will think about it. Thank you for watching this video guys. We love fast food. It actually got us some trouble um, early on this trip because we were eating fast food <laughs> way too much. Um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye guys!